Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can download and install VMware Player on your Windows operating system. VMware Player is a virtual machine using which you can run a different operating system on your host operating system. For example, I have Windows as my host operating system. I can run different operating system like Linux or uh, Mac OS or other operating system on my uh, Windows operating system or I can even run uh, Windows 7 if I have uh, Windows 8 uh, as a host operating system. So basically you use VMware Player as a virtual machine which uh, runs different operating system as a virtual operating system on your host operating system so that you can use both operating system as at the same time without uh, you know uninstalling anything so to install a vmware player you just need to search for vmware player and the first link hopefully will be from uh, vmware.com so www.vmware.com just click this link from here and uh, in here what you need to do is you need to go to uh, downloads tab and in downloads tab you will be able to see different options here but VMware player is at the very bottom so just go at the bottom and just uh, search for this VMware player and in front of this you will be able to see this link download product just click this link from here and in here you will be able to see a uh, different version so VMware player for Windows 64 VMware player for Linux 64 but right now I'm running Windows 8 as my operating system so I will choose this which is VMware player for Windows 64 click this link and then it will download VMware player executable file so using this VMware player uh, if you have the ISO file of any operating system you will be able to install it in this uh, VMware player and you can run it uh, from your uh, you know without closing your uh, host operating system you can run on your host operating system this guest operating system for example Ubuntu uh, if you want to install it on uh, VMware player and this uh, Ubuntu or uh, Linux Mint which is which are the f uh, flavors of Linux you can run on your Windows without uh, you know closing it or without uh, you parallelly booting uh, this on your machine so now this download is almost complete once this VMware download is complete you just need to click this uh, executable file and click yes and I will minimize everything in the meantime and then just click next and if you agree with license and conditions just click I accept terms and condition click next and then here is the directory where VMware play will be installed so I will leave it as default and I will click next and it says check for the product update I will generally leave it as checked and click next and help improve uh, you can leave it as uh, default and click next and if you want to create a desktop menu and start menu you can leave uh, these um, as checked so I want them as uh, the desktop menu and start menu program folder so I will leave them as checked and click next and click the continue and in some moment this VMware setup will complete so it, it, it's saying that this may take several minutes so be patient and wait for this process to complete and now the VMware player setup is complete and just click finish 
and VMware player is installed in, on your system and I can see this uh, desktop icon here I can just double click this desktop icon and it will open VMware player and for the first time it says use VMware 7 for free for non-commercial use and you just need to give your email address for uh, their promotional something promotional ads or something if you want to uh, use this uh, as a free tool so I will give my email address and then I will just click continue and click finish and now VMware player is ready to use so in this VMware player you can install for example different operating systems for example whenever I want to create a new virtual machine I can click this uh, button create a new virtual machine and in here I can select an ISO file which I want to install in my system for example Ubuntu ISO or Windows 7 ISO or whatever and this operating system will run on this virtual machine so I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you uh, will install VMware player on your um, Windows 8 and Windows 8.1 operating system for uh, uh, using different operating systems on your native computer so that's it for now and bye for now